What's your name, Leland? Happy Student Council Pajama Day! Today is Monday, March 6, 2023, and welcome to this episode of Our Daily Video Announcements. I'm Diana. And hello, I'm Aubrey. We're so excited to have this great opportunity to join you on the Daily Video Announcements. Now, please stand, place our hand over our heart, and honor this amazing country as we say the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you all, and please be seated. Remember, check your emails throughout the day. Welcome to Student Council Spirit Week, and be PBIS responsible young adults. Be safe, responsible, respectful, and be positive problem solvers. Mark your calendars and manage your to-do checklist. Today is pajama day. You all look pretty comfy. Okay, tomorrow is twins day. Who are you going to be twins with tomorrow? Wednesday needs some planning too. Wednesday is anything but a backpack day. I am so excited. Be creative. And I can't wait to see what people come up with that day. Thursday is decade day. And then we end this week with Freaky Friday, the teacher student edition. Ooh, that sounds fun. Mm, which teachers should I switch with? Finish strong, Sycamore family, with your academics up through our personal learning day and spring break. All right, March is Women's History Month. We'll be recognizing women who have made significant contributions in history. Although, this is plenty. Today, we're recognizing Helen Keller. Hi, uh, today's Women's History Month recognition is Helen Keller. Keller, who became blind and deaf as a result of a childhood illness, learned to communicate with hearing people by having signals pressed into her palms, reading lips by the way of touch, reading and writing braille, and eventually speaking audibly. Helen Keller was the first blind and deaf person to go to college and even wrote her own book. Helen Keller is such an important woman in history, and, with, and without her, many things would not be the same. Thank you. Now, over to our Footloose crew with a special announcement. Hi, we are the cast of Footloose. I'm Jaden, and I play Ren McCormick. I'm Salem, and I play Ariel Moore. I'm Lexi Evans, and I play Rusty. I'm Ollie, and I play Willard. I'm Patrick, and I play Reverend Shaw Moore. I'm Lexi C, and I play Ethel McCormick. I'm Nathan, and I play Chuck. We want you guys to come and join our show. The dates are March 9th, 10th, and 11th. Hey, Ollie, what's Footloose about? It's about a town called Beaumont, and it does not allow dancing. Uh, and it's where Ren slash Jaden comes to town, and he does not agree, and he wants to make some changes. Come to our show to see what happens next. Bye! Bye. <laughs> Just a reminder to add your favorite pet to the Pet of the Week area on our communications classroom, OZUJS35, as well as complete Evan's survey of the week to see how many like chocolate versus caramel. Results coming soon. Next up, birthdays! Happy birthday to William P. and Oliver M. Have a wonderful day. Yes, happy birthday to all celebrating today and hope you have an amazing birthday. Now, over to Mr. Harris. Good afternoon. It gives me great pleasure to present this week's Students of the Week. So we have three Students of the Weeks up here. They've been nominated by their teachers for being safe, for being responsible, being problem solvers, and being respectful. So our first student is Roxy Willert. Wilford, excuse me. Roxy. And Roxy was nominated by Mrs. DiOrio. So there's your Chick-fil-A. And here's your idea. Congratulations. Our next student is Tyler Marcel. Come on over, Tyler. Tyler was nominated by Mr. DeJoy for being safe, for being responsible, being a problem solver, and being respectful. So congratulations, Tyler. You got your Chick-fil-A already, right? All right, here's your certificate. Thank you. All right. And last but certainly not least is Emma Christensen. And Emma was nominated by Mrs. Darbyshire for being safe, responsible, being a problem solver, and being respectful. So all of our students of the week get a certificate, they get a Chick-fil-A gift card, and all of you can go out there if you emulate these PBIS characteristics. So congratulations to all of our students of the week. Yay! Give it up, give it up, give it up, give it up. All right, thank you and have a great day. Good afternoon, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your daily video announcements. Hey, congratulations to an, are in order to all of our participants in the District Fine Arts Fair this weekend. So all the people who played in the different instrumental groups that played, all the people who had art exhibited at the Fine Arts Show, congratulations, great job. Hey, we're pr very proud of you guys here at the Junior High. 
Next thing is, uh, a couple of you have been borrowing uh, technology from the media center. So they're going to crack down on you borrowing stuff for the simple reason that you don't return what you borrow. Okay? Remember, at the high school, if you forget your technology, you're just out of luck that day. So you need to start learning to be responsible here. If you borrow it from the media center, you need to make sure to bring it back because they're just not going to let you borrow stuff anymore. Don't forget, this weekend on March 9th, 10th, and 11th, Sycamore Junior High Spring Musical Footloose will be going on at the high school. So Sycamore Junior High Musical Footloose going on at the high school this weekend. That's March 9th, 10th, and 11th at 7 o'clock. Visit aves.org or scan the barcode provided to buy your tickets. Hey, that's it. You guys have a great day, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, Mr. Harris. Now over to Mr. DeJoy and Mr. Stern with our character award recognition. Good afternoon, Aviator Nation. Mr. DeJoy and Mr. Stern here for this week's character awards. Um, somebody said there were 54 days until 8th grade day. Man, so, fantastic. Coming up. It's going to be here before you know it. No doubt. So uh, make sure that you are getting your work done, more specifically talking to the 8th graders and staying off of the discipline log. If you are racking up some discipline, especially as we are making our way towards 8th grade day, your 8th grade day will be spent here and that is no fun. So um, do what you need to do and do the right thing and that's what we're here to talk about, people who are doing Absolutely. the right thing. And uh, I have three today, but they are all for the same person, which oh, wow. you know, sometimes we do get duplicates, but we don't typically get duplicates on the same day. Um, these all go out to Owen Carr, and, and they really kind of have a pretty similar theme. Uh, he's always there to help me out in times of need, somebody I can always rely on. Owen was nice to me when I was new to school in fifth grade. And then this one says, we first met. Um, things were tough for me, especially making friends. Um, but you always accepted me. We met again this year, and you are still thoughtful as ever. So, hey, we appreciate Owen. You're doing some great things, definitely having an impact on quite a few individuals. So keep doing that great work. Right, great job, Owen. And Right now, we have one of the stars of video announcements uh, selected as our character award winner this week. Sam Brocksterman, and this person wrote, he has been my friend since first grade, and ever since then, he's made me a better person. He always cheers me up when I'm sad, and he's always there for me in the darkest of times. Sam, thank you very much. We appreciate what you do, and I know this friend right here appreciates um, Appreciate you. Yeah, and it, you know, watching some of the uh, news crew um, throughout the week, you can tell that he's having a lot of fun yep. uh, with news crew as well. Hey, we've got one large uh, top, one large one topping pizza for each of our winners today. Where are you heading this week? Okay, I'm gonna be with Mr. Reese's class, and I will be with Miss Reinhardt. Um, but actually, I will be there on Tuesday this week as there are some things going on on Thursday. But, hey, we usually go to classrooms on Thursday, but you can make a difference any day of the week. All right, have a great day. Thanks, and nice work, students. Thanks for doing the right thing and helping others. Now it's time for Joke of the Day. Okay, so Mr. Heffron, you were chosen to do the Joke of the Day. Um, so think of one on the top of your head. Okay, so... What did the acorn say when it fell from the tree? What? Gee, I'm a tree. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Next up, Sam with Magical Monday. Savannah? Savannah! Where, where are you? She's with me. You've entered our territory and now you don't have permission. So now you, you and your friend are coming with me. Wait, stop! What if we leave right now and never come back? Would that be okay? Well, I guess so, but... Hello! Run! Thanks, Sam. Now, be extraordinary and follow BBIS expectations every day. And... and go Waves!